Hey, everybody. Okay, I've actually got this running on Microsoft Bing. I almost forgot to record tonight. Uh, let me take a look at my settings. Yeah, I, uh, I'm i going to go ahead and record like this, but I, I tried some new settings. And I, I'll see what it looks like when it gets done. I'm, uh, it's got less CPU usage. My frame rate will not maintain at 30 and it could be because i'm running the web browser. it's coming back up to 25 it might be because i'm running the web browser for some reason the web browser just does not want to work with this thing now let's see how this thing works yeah this is bing not google this might not be working as well with obs i don't know Yeah, the reason it might be doing I don't have a ad blocker on this one like I do on Chrome. So that might be why it's acting up, and maybe it'll settle down. I'll, I'll see what it looks like. Like I said, I'm trying to, and this is actually working better than it did on Chrome. If the, if the picture quality doesn't suffer too much, I might continue to play it on this. Okay, let's take a look at the store and see what we got. I'm going to kind of go through a little bit of everything just to see how this thing runs. Okay, we won't be spending any money because I don't have any. Uh, if I did have money, I would spend it on either better equipment, food, and or medical stuff. Ooh, the dragon pack. I'm not sure if I got the abysmal tear. That one I might have. And I still got the tour rider. Labor Day Mystery Box. Yeah, I'm not going to spend any on that. The dragon pack. Yeah, I still don't have enough for the dragon pack. Okay, what I am going to do is I'm going to drop 500 on that. And let's see what's on the mutants. This does seem to be working. I, I think I'm going to have to keep playing this on the bang. It does seem to be. I just hope the video quality doesn't suffer. Okay, we got all new experiments. Now, this is the one I care about the most because uh, the experiment. Uh, because I absolutely care about the prizes on this. You get platinum stars and other things on here. So this is definitely one that's worth finishing. And not, apparently not all the time, because the last time I think they had Hesphestus again, which I'd already won, but I usually don't have the mutants that are in there, so... See how fast we can get to the bottom on this. Oh, I'm definitely able to scroll on this thing better. Actually, I don't need that. I do need gold and platinum. Now, the thing to remember on this one when you do it, you don't get all of your mutants. Like, I'll have to go look. I don't know which ones they're going to let me use this time. Yeah, with gold and platinum, I'm not getting a very good selection of mutants. So we're going to go ahead and open it up to uh, these guys. The unstarred. Okay, Prince Scorpio is a uh, uh, 
one of the Sagittarius, yeah, one of the uh, constellation ones. Same thing with Sagittarius. So these guys, I can go ahead and level up. Don't want any tags. If you're having problems with this game, uh, I think before you play it, you need to go in and uh, toggle off your hardware acceleration and toggle it, toggle it back on. Because this thing was struggling a little bit when I started. I did that, and it definitely is working better on Bing than it was on Chrome. The music isn't half bad on this. I think I'll do five attacks on this, and then I'll go do my uh, PvP, and I'll do the rest uh, off stream, just because it's it's moving kind of slow. And you know, but again, if if you want me, I if 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 there's enough, if there's people that will actually watch a longer video, I will be more than happy to do them. I'm gonna play this anyways, but. I just don't want to put up a long, boring video that's not going to get watched. I'd rather make a shorter video that, because I am getting views on this. I really am. And the uh, Sunday play that I'm doing on the uh, Bunny, Bunny Kingdom realm, I'm getting views on that too, on YouTube. So, I mean, it's basically where I'm getting the views is where I'm going to put my effort on putting stuff up on YouTube. Because uh, I'm, I'm trying to work with some editing software. I'm going to try and make these better for you. I, I'm, I might fail. I'm doing the best I can, and it's probably not going to be enough. But um, the ones that are doing the best unedited are the ones that I'm going to put the priority on to make better. Um, because if they're getting if they're getting decent coverage when they're not edited, I'm hoping if I edit them properly and make them a little better, maybe not a lot better, but maybe a little better that they'll, uh, they'll get better views on it. That's what I'm hoping. Um, and if you want to help out, if you like what I'm doing, you want to help out, uh, there will be links to my Twitch and my Twitter and my discord. I don't have an Instagram or a Facebook yet for this Facebook. I don't use that much off of this. And I'm having trouble putting content up on the other stuff. So I don't think I'm going to do a Facebook. In fact, in, uh, when I stream, one of the one of the overlays I got says Twitch is dead to me. The Nordic Nightmare is uh, it's a double gene. Uh, it's a single gene. They're all uh, they're all the red ones, and so those ones there, I am not going to uh, battle until I need to charge them up because I can actually use those for breeding. And I I don't want to, if the higher level they are, the harder it is to get them to uh, to get them to charge back up. So I just I can't see doing it. You know, for those of you who have been watching it, you know, um, if you don't mind, please give it a like, like, share, subscribe. Uh, again, you know, if I put up videos of this and I see my subscriber count going up, I see the likes going up, I see the views and the analytics of people are watching them. That's where I'm going to be pumping my uh, my effort and I'm going to be pumping the effort into that first to make it better. And I will be putting the effort into putting them out. Uh I'm, it's going to be, 
I'm going to do the best I can, but right now I'm kind of scrambling because I have to get some yard work done because uh, one of the other people here is kind of useless and lazy. And the older, the elderly family member that's kind of taking me in, it's the only reason I'm alive. This person is nice enough to take me and feed me and try and take care of me. Um, they're, they're, they're old. They probably got as many, if not more health issues than I do. And, uh, I mean, a lot of it's just from being old. They've had a good life, but you know, they've, they've got problems and they don't need to be out there. Um, uh, you know, cause the way I've looked at it and I'm being just, I'm just trying to be honest. Um, if they die, I'm dead. If I die, they can keep going on living. You know, it's, uh, you know, it's just no way to put it. Just no other way to really put it. Uh, so that's my priority. Uh, I've already told the other person that she's taken in. It's like, you know, hey, dumbass, you know, our job is to keep her alive because when she dies, we're dead. At least I am. Um, I, I don't think he gets it. He is, there is a reason why his wife kicked him to the curb. There, there really is, and he doesn't get it. Uh, my understanding is there's been more than one family member that's already told the person that took us in that um, they hope he dies first because nobody wants to take him in. And I haven't heard that said about me, you know. <laughs> I haven't heard, so I, I don't know. I might have options, but I doubt it. You know, I, uh, you know the people that probably could take me, and I don't think they're going to want to. So it's like, you know. And I'm, I'm on borrow, borrowed time because I don't think, you know, with the age of that person, unless they live to be 100, I am not going to be able to stay around long enough until I get my Social Security. I'm, I'm just not. Uh, okay. I do kind of find this game, I, I probably shouldn't, um, but I do find this game fascinating. I really do. Ooh, Prince Scorpion's about to go up. Oh, hang on. I got Minecraft running. I've already had... Uh, I've already had lightning take out a bunch of shit. I, uh, when this game, when I sort of started playing on this server, and I've, I've got video up on this. This is, uh, this is the game, the one I'm talking about. It's the one I Twitch stream on, uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Well, I came by here the other day, and I have no idea how many times it's taken a hit. But I came by the other day, and there were all these bees flying around over by it. And uh, and I thought it was from the uh, the trees and stuff that I had planted. Because uh, every now and then when I plant these trees, I get... Uh, I get... Uh, I've planted flowers by them. I'll get like a, a honey... A honey nest or a beehive. Uh, I think it depends on whether... I think the beehive are the natural ones. Well, I, I had bees flying around, so that's what I thought it was. Well, then when I looked, the whole corner of my... Uh, the whole corner, corner of my honey farm was, like, wiped out. When I started on this, they had uh, flame tick or fire, fire spread uh, turned off. And it got turned on, and they didn't warn anybody. Well, the, I... I found this out because I'm actually trying to build a uh, pretty good uh, honey or a pretty good gold farm on the, uh, the realm I play on Sundays because I need the gold for some of the stuff that I'm trying to build. And if you don't have fire tick on, you can't make the really efficient gold farms. So that's why it was turned on. I can, but I just wish they'd have given some warning. So I'm slowly because the lightning took out most of my turtles. I had a turtle farm, and I noticed I, I only had like a handful. I had literally like twenty or thirty turtles. I could go in there and uh, I can go in and breed up a whole bunch of them. 
So yeah, when I heard the I heard the thunder, I'm like, oh my god! So I, the and then I built a uh, mushroom uh, farm, and it kept taking that out, and they just wander off, and you know, because I had a whole bunch of those, and then I think they all either ran off or died or whatever, because I was down to like just a handful. I had to start breeding them again, and I'm like, man, you know, take one step forward, get kicked in the nuts, and shove five uh, five steps back. It was really frustrating, and. Uh, so what I've been doing is I've been slowly putting a glass roof, you know, up at like Y200 on all my farms. And the when I found the honey farm, one, cause he said, I have never had a problem. And recently they had, to, they, and again, I would just wish they would have given some warning. Maybe they didn't. I didn't see it in Discord. I, I can't just, and maybe I read it and forgot about it. I got to be completely honest. But uh, so I'm slowly putting these, uh, lightning suppression units over it see down the road i'd be i'll I'll actually build uh lightning rods and this stuff as soon as we get the copper but i honestly don't know if we're getting copper this summer or if we're not getting that until uh until like christmas time I, i really don't know oh here we go yeah, I got to admit, that I don't know, it, it might be just as slow, but the controls are easier for me to work with on this. Okay, battle number four. Yeah, the summary, if you take, this is all you got to do, like, when you do this one. And even if you can't win everything, you're going to get, gold, like, this one here, you're going to get gold stars and Omikami. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, and I apologize, but Omikami, that one there, I don't think I have. But yeah, the only mutants you're going to get on this one are the purple and the, the saber and the mystic ones, the purple and the red. And But the only ones you can't use are the uh, platinum ones, which sucks because I can't use my platinum glover, but I at least have a gold one. This is I, I cannot stress this enough. This was actually a big game changer for me. If you ever get to where you can get a glover, Make it a priority to breed them up to a gold or a purple. And if you're watching this, and if you have another game game uh, game breaking tip, another game changing tip like the Glubber Steel Garden's another one. Although I just got one, I was able to buy one for coin, I think, and I got him. And I think I've got him up to silver. I haven't been breed. A, I haven't been able to. I might not. That might be just bronze. But I think I've actually bred him up to silver. But I haven't got a gold one or a platinum one yet. But my understanding, and I can kind of see it in just just the little bit that I've done with them now. But that's another one that's like a game changer. Uh, Picky Gamer was the one that put me onto those two. And the other one that's a game changer, especially for uh, leveling up, are the bounty hunters. And I think there's actually, I think there's actually other mutants that generate more coin than the bounty hunter. But I don't have any of them yet. One of them I think is like a banker, and I'm not sure, but the the Midas one might be or something, King Midas or something like that. But I'm not sure. But I think there's at least one more mutant that actually generates more more coin than the bounty hunters. But I don't have it. And I'm not exactly, I think it's the banker one. But I've got, I think, four four bounty hunters. And every now and then I try to breed another one. But those ones there, you got to breed those quite a few times before you get one. And I just don't want to waste the time and energy uh, pumping out crap mutants. That I, I mean, if I had a better shot at getting them, uh, I would do more of them for sure. Uh, okay, let's take out. I don't know who the hell that guy is. Let's take out Treebeard there. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to drop this guy. I don't think I'll. I don't think I'll have enough juice to drop him. No.
he didn't do very much damage. That's good. Kind of like when they don't do a lot of damage. Oh, okay, I can take this guy out. Should be able to. And I think he's a heavier hitter than the other one. Horse to horse. Yeah, I'm having, I would normally fire up the soundboard. That, that's why I just can't believe these little rinky-dinky games are causing so many problems. But, uh... If I wasn't having so much trouble getting this to run, I would fire up a soundboard, but I don't want to lag it out any more than it is. I'm going to end up dropping a bunch of these because I have had some uh, issues uh, from using the soundboard. I gotta, If you're using a soundboard or thinking about it, just be real careful the sounds you use. I mean, I didn't get into any trouble, uh, and I do want to thank YouTube for that. When you upload stuff to YouTube, they before they let you make it public, they scan it over for copyrighted, you know, things. And it's it's generally they're just scanning it ahead of time. Nobody's officially complaining. And I think what they do is if they if they notice this stuff that's likely copyrighted and they know who owns it, they flag them. And I got to be honest, I'm glad they do it. It, I do not want the legal hassles. I literally do not want the legal hassles. Right now, I think the game plan is going to be is I'm going to do the first five fights. I'll do the next five or ten off stream. And then when I get done with this fight, I'm going to go ahead and uh, do my PvP fights. I, I can usually do two of them. Sometimes I can do more, just a matter if I mind. Like, if, if I've got the, if they got a thing where you need to uh, fight so many PDPs to check off a, a, a prize, then I'll go in there and I don't care if I win or lose. But when it's just for the tournament and there's no bonus prizes, I usually don't like to fight unless I've got a reasonable chance. I don't win all of them, but I don't like to go in there and, you know, win two out of two out of ten. I don't like doing that. So I usually just do do the fights when I have a tag that I can use. You know, the, I, the one thing I do wish is you've got the mute, mutop, mute, uh, Mutopia or whatever, the little uh, the little creature catalog of all the mobs, of all the monsters that you can fight in here. When you've actually fought one and defeated it, I wish at least the version you defeated would show up in there. Because there's so many in there that I go in there because I don't own one, it's all dark. And I wish the picture would at least show up on the ones that you've defeated. Um, I, I, don't, I don't really know how to explain it, but it would make it nice if you could go in and actually see what the thing looks like. And if you've already defeated one, at least that version, if it's a, oh, if it's like a special one from the uh, the reactor, or if it's a, a starred one or a non-starred one, it, it should be on there in my mind. Yeah, I think it's just as slow, but I got to be honest with you, the, the maneuvering things around are a lot better on this.
And this one here I'm doing, this is Friday night for me. Well, actually, it might be Saturday morning. But uh, this is Friday night for me. And this one here I'm not going to do, but I probably should. I like to do them once in a while. They take Those take gold to activate. And uh, I, actually, since it's Friday, I think uh, Fridays I'll do... Uh, I'll do one of these. I might not be able to beat this. Uh, let's find out. Okay. Ooh, Mr. Marvelous. That's, uh, I've got Triple B. I've got Buck Maurice, but I do not have uh, Mr. Marvelous. I don't know if I'm going to win this one. I'm not going to use my glubbers. I'm trying to do it on stream. I will I will probably do this later if I don't make it. But uh, I usually like to do one of these every now and then. But I, maybe I should start doing like one a week, at least until I can't beat it. Uh, and then wait for wait for another level up. But I just leveled up, so I might actually be able to do better on this than I think. Uh, okay, Mr. Marvelous. Ooh, this is not looking good. <laughs> All of these guys hit a ton. Mr. Marvel is, is probably going to drop one of them when he hits. Ooh, he survived. That was your best effort there, Mr. Marvelous. Okay, I don't think I can drop the uh, the linebacker there, so I'm going to basically hit Mr. Marvelous. I don't think I'm going to win this one, but we're going to see. But I would like to drop at least one of these guys before I die. I'm going to do this just because I, I can't remember. I think this guy cuts your attack. So I'm hoping to do a lot of damage and make it so whoever he hits can survive it. That's because if I can keep both of these guys fighting, the gargoyle can drop Mr. Marvelous this time. Then he'll get to attack again, and I might be able to win this. Yes. Okay, I survived. I'm hoping this guy can drop Mr. Marvelous now. Oh, come on. Okay, I don't think I'm going to win this. I do not think I have enough stuff to... Used to play Axis and Allies a lot, board game. And we played with this one guy who'd been, uh, 
he was actually a really good guy. I don't want to, I, I, if I say anything that makes him sound like a, 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 a you know, a, a weirdo stranger, that's not the case. He was actually a really cool guy. Well, he, he was like another one of these chess players. Like the one friend I had, I got him hooked on it. Well, he got all his chess buddies hooked on it. And, uh, This one guy, he knew someone in the military, and the he made the comment the one time that this guy he knew in the military always used to tell him that, you know, stuff was good. You know, like when I, he he mentioned it every now and then when he was uh, buying stuff, he'd be like, "Well, yeah, and one guy I knew was in the military. He always said stuff was good. Yeah, if you're in war, stuff is having stuff is better than not not having stuff." Uh. Yeah, I think this is the end of my little adventure here. Yeah, he took me out all by himself. Yeah, that, uh, I forget what, I think it's Triple B, that linebacker dude, he just hits a ton. Uh, one of my tags, uh, the guy uh, guy named Andre, The uh, his tag, that's who I bring in. I think it's the gold one. If it's not the gold one, it's the silver one. But that guy, does, I don't know what level it is on him, but that guy, apparently it's his best mutant because no matter who I attack, that's the one that comes in. Okay, I didn't make it. I did not make it. I'm sorry. I let everybody down. I couldn't do it. And let's see how we're at. Ooh, four attacks, but I only went down negative five. Okay, we're going to take both of these guys. Yeah, this, I think it is just a little bit faster on Bing. Um, I don't know if I really want to add another web browser on here, but who knows, maybe I will, maybe I will look and see if there is a better, but I don't know. This one here is working pretty good. And I'm feeling pretty good about this one. So I'm going to take Andre in. Ooh, I don't even know that dude with the binoculars. Uh, well, he's got a chick on his bag, but I don't even know who the hell that guy is. The other two I've seen, the uh, the little purple dude, the I think it's uh, Ed 404 or something like that. I got to take that dude out stat, or he drops pretty much a mutant every turn. Yeah, he's got the gold one, I think. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to win this one or not. I don't think it would have mattered. If I can't beat him with this one, I don't think I'd have beaten him with uh, Eva either. I don't I don't think either one of my tags would have been more of a help against this, but I think I'm going to drop one or two of his mutants now. Nope, one. Now let's just see how much damage. If that guy does zero damage, I got a chance. I absolutely have a chance that this guy does zero damage. Okay, he survived. Now who is uh, the tank going to... This dude just hits a ton. I've currently got one of these guys up to silver. I want to get him up to platinum and then just max him up. Oh my god. 
that is the first time I've been hit by one of these guys, even even hitting them with my glovers. Uh, there's certain mutants that do not. They either have so much damage they do, or they've got some natural resistance to the glubber, that glubber effect. But uh, that's the first time one of these guys at this level has hit me, and it has not completely wiped me out. I'm thinking the other ones might have the... Uh, all the boosts on where they do extra damage or something like that is the first time I've ever taken a hit from one of these guys and survived, especially when he hit my uh, Easter gunny and he'd already taken damage. Oh my God. That is awesome. Oh yeah, got one more. I'm gonna have to look. I'm gonna have to heal some guys up. Okay, 165, I'm going to try and take the uh, Dragon's Mother in. This might be a mistake, but let's try it. And I got to heal up my Gold Glover. Okay, let's go ahead and fight. Round one. And we'll take Eva in. You know, as your levels go up, Eva's levels should go up. Like, she should at least stay five or ten levels behind you because she's supposed to be some big nut wheeling uh, mutant, mutant coach or something like that. Uh, this guy's a pain in the ass. Guy in the middle. And uh, uh, this transformer tank or whatever, he's another one that does a buttload of damage. So I really want to drop him. That guy at the top, I'm not really sure what that is. Uh, I really don't have a clue. Oh, and if you're looking at my image up there, I'm not doing that because of COVID. That was from Christmas a couple of years ago. And uh, I, my niece has the, the sweetest, most lovable pit bull. And uh, the pit bull likes me. And so we would go, like, my sister would usually have, like, uh, Christmas and New Year's. You know, we'd go into her house. She'd cook. And... Uh, my niece would bring her pets, usually. And Luca would sit with me a lot. That's the name of her dog. Luca really, like, I asked my sister the one time. She was babysitting. I stopped. We stopped in. And when I was home visiting, this when I was still working. Uh, and I asked her, I go, does she remember me? Because she, she always seemed real friendly when she would see me. I go, does she remember me? Or uh, she liked this for everybody. And my sister's like, no, nah, she's not like this. She has, uh, she has two daughters and one son. And her younger daughter's friends from high school would sometimes stop over. And as soon as Luca saw him, she'd be like, oh, it's you again. She So she's not like that for everybody. And, uh, but she always seemed to remember me. Ooh, I might be losing this one. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, that one guy. Oh, man, and he regenerates all my cats in here. 
and she's figured out that there's fresh air and freedom coming from over by the window. She's checking it out. Behave, Patches. Patches, behave. Yeah, she's over there investigating the window. She can smell that freedom. Ooh, this is not good. I think I just lost this one. Well, you see it here, warts and all, folks. Warts and all. It all depends on how much my uh, dragon mother can catch is. You be good girl. Well, you know, even if I lose, I don't feel too bad because I got him down to one. I don't think I can take this dude out because this guy heals a ton, and I think he can drop me with one shot. What do we got here? I think this is my best shot, but I don't think I'm going to... I don't know. This one here, I don't think I've ever... I don't remember this one if I've ever faced it before. Yeah, I didn't do any damage. I think he's still got a shield even after I hit him. Yeah, and I can't. I can't. Yeah, he does. He could. Ooh, man. I think he did twice as much damage as he needed to, and that's after he suffered uh, the uh, the nerfing to his attack and, and my shield. Yeah, I did not have a chance. I, I don't know. I feel pretty good about taking that out considering what I got. Yeah, my Glubbers are maxed out again. Yeah, I think I'm just going to drop everything I got, uh, except for maybe one, as soon as I can get them uploaded. But I, I was really struggling to get some uploaded because I basically had to uh, edit them for the, the copyright issues from the soundboard. That and I'm still using the soundboard, but I'm just not using the songs. Um, but... If I keep having problems like I had this week, um, I am going to quit using it, but I'm just basically getting rid of all the songs on it. And uh, But as long as I don't have too many problems, when I have problems with it, I'll, like if, if they tell me something's copyrighted, I'll just get rid of it from the soundboard. But if I have another week like this... Uh, I'll find some other way to, to entertain the crowd because uh, I'm not kidding you. That was nuts. I even had some on this. Uh, well, I know, I know a couple of these I used the soundboard, but I, it was usually just one or two of uh, an episode. But the one I uploaded now, this one here, I knew was gonna knew might be a problem because uh, it was after the the Chavin. Uh, This one here, I'm not kidding you. If you are, oh, excuse me, this is another game changer, and I really owe this to. I mean, it was out there. I just never really knew. But Picky Gamer's the one that uh, explained it to me. This really helped. Uh, you look at if you if if you look at this, you see I got like you know just six hundred of this. Uh, now the ten thousand med med kits that I got, that is basically from. Uh, every time I get on, I. Uh, I claim the ones I got and I buy new ones. So I'm constantly, but I don't always come in here. I, I've got plenty. So I don't come in here all the time, although I should, because I could actually use the stars. Um, if I get enough bronze stars, I can turn them into silver and gold. And, you know, the platinum ones I'm doing okay. Like, see so that one there, I got, uh, I got some of these uh, big med kits. 
But these ones here, uh, I cannot begin to tell you, this is the way to go because you get so much of the uh, material you need to do well. You get the uh, the XP bonuses like that. You get the uh, you get the regeneration boosts. You get the crit shields and the uh, crit uh, bonus. Those are the ones you get the most of. I think are the uh, the ones you use. Oh, that's the that you know. I might have won that fight. I uh, I forgot to use my power ups. That is my fault. <laughs> But you get these orbs. Uh, if I did it more often, I would have more of those orbs. But I get a fair amount of orbs. I mean, but if you if you really put the time into this, uh, and I've even seen the people they go and buy extra uh, med stations, they get more of these med kits. Uh, I've seen like Picky. I think he's got like five or six of them or something. You occasionally get these. I don't know if I've ever gotten a mutant reactor out of here, but I've gotten those, and I think the uh, the, the orange ones, too. I've gotten some of those, but usually if you get any of them, it's the green ones. See, now that one there, now this is because I never get the, the level three orbs unless I'm using seven med kits. You can use four, five, six, and seven. I think you can, basically when you put these in, as soon as that thing goes green, you can cash it in. Like I put these in one at a time. Okay, you can do as little as three. As soon as that craft button lights up. But occasionally when I use seven of these things, I can get a level three orb occasionally it's really rare but i've never seen one i've never seen one when i was using less than seven and i think it starts at five but when you use like five or six or more whenever you get the level one orbs you get two of them but you can get this to drop stars, orbs, uh, other various power-ups. And so if you're watching this, if you've got any black hole recipes, please, please put them in the comments and share them with everybody. Um, if they don't use the tokens, like the mutant reactor tokens and the other ones, I, I might even try them. You know, I might even try and give you a shout out. But I, I'm just not using any of those tokens. I actually need the stuff I can buy them with. But if I ever get to where I don't need them, then I might be willing to try them. But I'm just, I'm not pissing them away. I, the, the, these three here, these three tokens, like these ones here, when I cash those in and when I cash these in, I usually get a mutant that's actually pretty tough and pretty useful. And the, these ones here are nice because I can sometimes get one of the... Uh, I can sometimes get one of the mutants that I need to uh, clear up my, uh, to fill out my bingo, uh, my bingo cards that I otherwise couldn't get. And then I can start breeding them sometimes. So no, I'm not pissing away any of those right now. Uh, oh, I'm waiting for it to clear. This thing's so slow. I'm waiting for it to clear. I didn't realize it already had. But yeah, this this is a good one to get. You just put those in, you click this in, and then, I mean, if you're if you're a newer player, if you're if you're an advanced player, you can probably give me tips and by all means, put them in the comments. Uh, and while you're there, you know, please like, share, and subscribe. Uh, get your friends to watch it if you like this, because if I get if I see the reaction, I'm going to keep making these videos.
Yeah, if you got if you got this thing running at normal speed, it's but I mean, this still is. I mean, like I said, this is the best of it. I got to keep playing this on Bing, and if I can find something better to play it on, I absolutely will. And the other thing is whenever you approach a holiday on this game, whenever you approach a holiday, what you want to do, oh, I forgot to do this at the beginning. I forgot to check my gold farms. I think it's a gold furnace and a gold forge are what these are called. This one here is going to take another 19 hours. But around every holiday starting, you, you want to play this every day, especially around the holidays. But uh, you want to come in here on the holidays because the holidays are usually when they do the discounts. Like as soon as they, I'm hoping that if they do do another, uh, another good discount for Labor Day, uh, they didn't do it for, either I missed it or they didn't do it for uh, Valentine's Day or not Val Easter. Either I missed or they didn't do it, and then they did one. The one they just did, that might have been for uh, for Labor Day. I don't know, because sometimes they do them either before, during, or after, and there's no rhyme or reason. But this is why you want to save your coin, because right now it's going to take me uh, 161 million to upgrade. I, I think that's, yeah, 161 million. To upgrade when if they offer like a 50% off it's only going to take me a little over 80 million and I've almost got that and if I had the 100 like let's say I did have the 161 million if they even offer it at a 50% discount instead of upgrading once you'll be able to upgrade twice and usually on the holidays they'll sometimes do like a 60 or 70% discount and in that case I would even be able to upgrade now so yeah, you want to save that coin, and uh, but if you, if you get on once a day, like right now when I get on once a day, I've got ninety uh, campaign tickets that I can cash in. But uh, these things, and as you win them in the uh, as you win them in the events, you can if you look here, you can see I've got all my like things together. You've got brighter purple ones and darker purple ones. You got brighter yellow ones and darker yellow ones uh, let's see how much i can zoom out on this i've got bright red ones and regular red ones bright blue and regular i don't have any bright green ones well the ones that are brighter they are the fancier they're like the zone deluxe they hold more coins so if you're someone as soon as you get them you want to swap them out and put them in and if they're if they only hold three mobs you are monsters you want to upgrade them so they'll hold four but these things will hold more coins so if you're someone like me that only plays like once or twice a day you won't have these things fill up and rob yourself of that coin uh so those are those as soon as you can win them in the events i, I don't recommend buying them uh, i don't recommend you buying anything on these games but that's because i don't have any money and that's my advice and i don't want to tell you to do something i wouldn't do myself you know but if I had money, who knows? I have I put a little money in it, but I think the only thing I really spent on was the uh, the gold forges and furnaces because I'm like, and that was a while ago when they were actually selling them. And that's something Picky has said. Back when they used to sell those, there were people that maxed out on them and they figured out how much of a mistake that was because you've got people that bought like, you know, 10 or 20 of these big ones. And so like every three days, they're getting like 500 gold. You know, or me, every three days I'm getting 150 gold. But every three, you know, every three days these guys are getting like 500 gold or more. And they figured out that was a mistake. That was absolutely a mistake. Well, for everybody that watches us and everybody that stuck with it for, uh, through the end, uh, I cannot tell you how much of you, uh, how much of a fan I am of you actually stopping in. My frames per second really crapped out, but I don't know if that's just when I'm switching uh, in between the browser and this, and that might be because of the Bing browser, but 
I can live with that because it allowed me to play the game. I just got to take a look and see how crappy the video is. If everything looks good, we're good. Uh, but peace out, and I want everybody to have a good day.